Good morning dear parents. In this video we will see how to ensure that your child has submitted the paper. A lot many times the teachers uh, you know keep telling that uh, the child has only viewed the paper and not submitted the paper. So uh, let's clear this that how as a parent you can know that you have actually submitted the paper and not just um, viewed the paper and closed it. So step number one is you go to the assignment here. Okay, this is from the mobile. I'm recording from the mobile. The procedure will be same for, uh, for the lab computers or laptops also. So you can see the assignment tab here. Let me just highlight it for you. So this is the assignment tab. All right. Then click on the assignment tab. You will see your classes. <clears throat> so go to class three. Go to the next class. So uh, as you can see here. So what I have done is this was a test account. So uh, first. I assigned a test paper to this which was EVS PT1 revision EVS PT1 okay and uh, I had I completed the paper all right so what happens is that assigned that paper which I assigned here the assignment which I assigned here and when I completed it it will be visible in the completed section see I'll just show you it will be visible here now this is I am saying from a student's point of view okay this is not a teacher's account this is a test student account where I have I assigned a paper okay and I attempted it as a student all right so it will be visible here revision 1 PT 1 EVS okay where is it where is it uh, uh, visible I'll just show you again in which section just see here this is the two sections okay in the assignment tab, you, are, you have two sections. One is the assigned section and other is the completed section. So if I assign you an assignment and you have completed it and properly submitted it, then it will be available in the completed section only, in the second section. Okay. See, it is clearly visible that I have uh, submitted it. Moving forward, also another way of checking this when you click here on the submitted now this is a submitted assignment which is in the completed tab and when you open the assignment okay now teacher has not checked it okay you have already submitted so it clearly shows here your response has already been submitted so this these are two indications which very clearly states that your paper has already been submitted to the teacher okay the first being that it will be under the completed section all right and when you open it it will show you a thank you uh, response that you have already submitted now here i assigned the paper again to myself okay so this this you can see here that i have assigned it here testing purpose revision 1 pt1 all right now just see here suppose as a student i open it all right and i open the paper okay i have opened it before so you can see here that i have opened it before Okay, I, I was the one I just opened it two minutes before and I entered my name, I entered my class, but the remaining questions I did not answer. Okay, this could be the reason that I don't know the answers. So I, I must be thinking, okay, let me go back and revise my chapters again uh, and then I will come back and do this revision test paper. So I closed it. All right, I did not press on the submit button. I closed it. So it is a clear indication that the paper will still remain in the assigned column only. Okay, it will remain here and the answers also are there only. See, I made one change in front of you. I will show you. Uh, initially, it was written Vinny T-E-A-T, -E okay, which was my mistake. So, now I am going to show you that I corrected it in, in this video itself. So, I am going to show you that that answer is being updated here. So, don't panic if we say that, you know, your video, your uh, paper is only viewed. Okay, all the answers are going to remain there only. Don't worry. I have only written these two answers. So, these two answers were still there. Then I corrected it in front of you in this video. It is still there. So, don't worry. The answers are still there. The only reason that it is showing, um, it is showing there is that you have not clicked on the submit button. Okay. So, these are the, these are the only two things that I feel that, you know, um, is creating some sort of a confusion. Um because that's why I, because uh, so be careful whenever i give you any assignment and uh, if you uh, you know and uh, it has to go in your completed section okay forget about mine it has to go in your completed section from assigned section it should go to completed section with a tick mark okay you can also see that a tick mark is there see 
द टिक मार्क इज़ क्लियरली है ओके सो दीज थिंग्स जस्ट स्मॉल स्मॉल थिंग्स कीप इन माइंड यू नो नाउ ऑनवर्ड्स आई होप यू आर क्लियर वेन आई सेट दैट चाइल्ड योर असाइनमेंट हैज़ बिन व्यूड एंड नॉट सबमिटेड सो जस्ट गो बैक टू योर असाइनमेंट विच विल बी वेयर इन द असाइन टैब ओके इट विल बी इन द असाइन टैब एंड जस्ट क्लिक ऑन द सबमिट बटन सो दैट इट गोज फर्दर टू द कम्प्लीटेड सेक्शन थैंक यू स्टूडेंट्स